With a cheer, Wesley College celebrates victory in this year's National Under-15 Secondary Schools Rugby Tournament. They played a game of two halves against fellow Aucklanders Mount Albert Grammar, who dominated early on. And that made Wesley's victory even sweeter, with the team's captain saying the win was hard fought. Because we have a leadership in our team and all we said to them was keep the faith. Work hard, work hard for this, we deserve to win, and that's it. The final marks the end of this week's under-15 rugby tournament in the city. 16 teams from across the country competed, shifting venues halfway when Logan Park became too muddy. And organisers say the final match was a great send-off. It's a cracking final between two outstanding sides and they're big, big boys, but they can play, play rugby as well and it was a great final. Okay, Wesley boys were down at half-time but dug deep in that second half and came back and took it 18-13. The tournament won't return to Dunedin for 15 years, and next time it'll take place up north. Ashwin says the local players performed well, continually improving throughout their games, and although they placed 15th, other southerners impressed. St Beards have had a fantastic tournament as well, just representing South Island, so they got third today, and they're, they're a really good side, a really gutsy side, and they did very, very well. Ashwin says the tournament's been a big boost for the local rugby scene and some of the nation's top up-and-coming rugby talents been revealed before the last blow of the whistle. David DeLorean, 39, Dunedin News.